these Starbucks baristas, I mean, they can handle everything. The, the complicated orders I throw at them, they never screw it up. They deserve to be paid more. That's why I tip them one dollar every week. Uh, the employee, Marty, he's my guy. Yeah, sometimes he even has my coffee ready for me right when I walk in the door. I still have to pay him. I still have to pay him. Santorini McCluskey, union electrician, union number 124. I work for a uh, software development company, but uh, my daughter's in Girl Scout Troop 124. It's very important to me to know where my coffee comes from. You know, like, oh, it's a Guatemalan roast, but like, where in Guatemala? I don't know what got into me today. I asked for seven pumps instead of four. Reminds me of my wife. <laughs> Six years of marital bliss so far. I mean, it's coffee, cream, and sugar. What else do you need? Long John? Frequently, I will schedule meetings with clients in here. It's amazing the barriers you can break down over a nice cup of steamed milk and sugar and a little bit of coffee. God, I love this place. I'm in and out two minutes tops. Don't make that joke, Ricky. Don't make that joke. I never plan it, but I always end up at this Starbucks location. It is right on the way home from the country club. Ah, why did I join that one, you know? I love this location because it's right down the street from my pharmacy, my kid's daycare, and the place I go for We Buy Gold. You ain't getting that chain from me, Ricky. Yeah, I do like my coffee sweet, just like my two kids. Persephone just had her first ballet recital, and Herbert is about to start oboe lessons. <laughs> Yeah, you know, just like his dad. He's gotta be an oboe sexual. I like my coffee strong, just like my boots. Steel toe. I mean, it's like this. I go to work clean, I come home dirty, but no matter what, the day can't stop before I have my first chug of joe with me. My software development job that I have, I don't know if I mentioned that yet, is can be very stressful on my mental state, so I like to wear the blue light glasses at least 60% of my working day. Am I prejudiced? Yeah, sure. I'll tell you right now, white people can't hang drywall with a plug nickel. <laughs> you can't. No, sir, no way. Not a prejudiced bone in my body. Although from time to time, I do prefer a flat white. Honey, not you. I got five gorgeous kids. Timmy, Tammy, Tommy, Betty, and Bobby. And I got a beautiful wife, Babs. She's a hairdresser down in the neighborhood. She grew up. She's a townie. Yeah, my wife and I, we've got our hands full here. Three kiddos of our own, you know, Persephone and Herbert, and then of course, Sparky, our golden doodle. Talk about a dog who loves Starbucks as much as me. Who's Papachinos? What's in those? <sighs> Oh, it is past 11 a.m. already. Okay, no thank you, caffeine. I want to be able to go to bed tonight. I tell you what, this stuff is like fuel to me. If I don't have it, I'm passed out by the top of the third in the Sox game. I mean, on Fridays, the foreman pays, so I get an extra large, maybe a half dozen. On Fridays, when I work from home, I like to really treat myself, so I, uh, I throw on a steak on the George Foreman. Talk about a good piece of meat seasoned just perfectly with salt. Next week is my birthday here, so I'm gonna get a venti and might even take a half day off work. <laughs> I just surf it. Yeah, my birthday's tomorrow, doesn't matter to me. I've been going to work every single birthday since I was 12. The only free sugar I need is from Babs. <laughs> mm. I wish pumpkin spice had never left. I wish Tom Brady had never left. Give them credit. The Red Sox made some noise. I'm honestly, give them some honestly, this guy doesn't know what he's talking about. I think the Red Sox missed an opportunity. Got my Starbucks right here. Got my meal prepped Tupperware in the car. Let's head to the office. Let's have a great day. Two things you need for every single job. Cup of Dunkin', thermos of chowder. Clam. Just got a tall today because I do have a Pilates session this afternoon. Uh, I like to get a little exercise in. Yeah, I exercise. It's called catching the F train. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe because I'm freezing my baguettes off for this YouTube channel. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate it, you guys. Uh, we're trying to get to 100,000. Or maybe by the time this came out, we're at 100,000. Or 200,000. 1,000. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys. So, oh, yeah, sometimes, sometimes he's already... Hey, how you doing, guy? Hey! Hey! <laughs> That's my aunt right there. She used to always get Dunkin' every single day before she had one of those corroded arteries. Now she goes Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. 